everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World again. Hey, are you, are you glad we're back again? Because not too long after we got, you know, the last video we did, which is, I think it was last week, uh, where we unlocked the Cryolophosaurus, would you believe that um, there's another, like, hybrid for it? And it is the Cryolophosaurus hybrid. So we're just going to quickly do the rounds before we, you know, invest into that one. Because we're going to have to. Uh, ooh, that's right. Yeah, I accidentally put some tournament creatures in. Uh, I could probably... S yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll sell these guys. We I don't think we need Lathornax or Bonogamous. We've already got those guys unlocked. If we really want to, we could probably just get rid of it. Um, then the hybrid, anyway, is probably going to be really expensive. I'm expecting like 70k. DNA, so oh, we're gonna need as much DNA as possible. Ooh, tempting, very tempting. I just wanna have a quick check in here just to see what kind of offers we get. Because when it comes to a hybrid, oh, I take that one. I don't care about the food. Um, how about that one? Yeah, go on. It's only 28. It doesn't really seem worth it. Uh, <laughs> oh, the no disorder. I Like, I've just got that in the event, and now it's like, no, 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 no. You don't want that. You want food, right? It knows. Decorate. Oh, I've only got five, four apatosauruses. That's why. Oh, okay. So that one will do that. I mean, these are all guaranteed. I think you get better trades in the randomized one. Uh, but we may as well do this one. So before we refresh, uh, what I will do... Oh, we need to, of course, open a pack and see if we get any more DNA. Little bit, little bit of books as well. Um, but we need to go into Isla Sauna. Oh my no, guys, he's Lasorda. Ooh, what are we doing over here? Except admiring our beautiful decorations. Uh, we're gonna go in here. We're gonna go. Oh god, where is it? Place. Yep, that's the one. Apparently, I've got one of those to place down as well, so I'll just plop that one down there. <laughs> but we need to switch that up and then just go one, two. And three. That that will probably do. We've already done one pop. I'd be very surprised if the game doesn't crash. And also, if um, we get more trades for our Palasaurus within the next two. So, we'll quickly refresh. And let's see. There it is. There's one already for a million food. Uh, and the final refresh. Does it give us anything good? Uh, no. No. Uh, but another one. So basically, we just transform two Apatosaurus statues into two million food. And if, you know... <coughs> and if you know anything about Jurassic World the game, uh, food is something that you can't just generate. Um, unless you're wanting to spend bucks on it, which I really wouldn't suggest. Uh, I, I actually... Have I... Have I... Did I get anything? Oh, we reset on that. Uh, no, we haven't unlocked anything else, and I opened all the packs. Oh, yeah, <laughs> since the last episode. I haven't really done any of this, which I probably should have, because we're close to another Shining Armor, but the chances of getting something good... You know what? 6% isn't so bad, I suppose. We do. We will get another one. We've got two more chances to get that. Apparently, I haven't got Nodosaurus or Triceratops, although they are unlocked, which is more important. That's the thing we need to worry about. If it's not unlocked, then it's like, oh, what do we do? So, with that being said, we'll collect some of that. And let's have a look. Where is Cryolophosaurus? Um, cryo. We're going to uh, carnivores. And Cryo. Where are you? There you are. There's the Cryolophosaurus. But if we go into hybrids and we scroll down, apart from all the other ones that I've already got and we don't need, uh, this I don't have because I don't have Gen 2. Don't have the bag of Thrupidun. But we do have. This is the Cryolobergiana. Virginia, Virgi, Virginia, Virginia. <laughs> that one. So we've also we've got the uh, the the other one, the armor Virginia. Uh, but we do have the Cryolophosaurus. So we've. I mean, good thing is there's no. Oh, hold on. Let's collect all of those. Yes. And actually, what I will do is I will quickly go into. Oh, where are we? Oh, there we are. We'll go into hybrids. No, hybrids. We're going to pteranodons. And I'll have a look for the, this one. Yes. Because if I haven't collected all those, oh, which we have. Okay, good. Uh, we got some of that. Well, I guess I could have done it, but I uh, just can't be bothered. <laughs> uh, we'll go into uh, hybrids. We'll get there eventually. Never mind. It's carnivores. And here is Cryolophosaurus. So we've had this thing all for all of two seconds, but we're now about to fuse it into something good and usable. So fuse. Uh, we do have an instant fuse, which we may as well use. We've only got one of those. 
Sweet. Okay, cool. <laughs> Weird for that to kind of break it, but you know, I was expecting a crash from the Asalamiopatosaurus statues, especially doing a very quick. If you don't want the crash, you have to do it very slow, one by one, need to go one. And we're back just like that. Not a problem. Uh, did we even fuse that dinosaur? I get the feeling that we didn't. Uh, no, we didn't. Okay, is this going to be like a dinosaur that I, I can't make because it breaks? No. Okay, so here it is. Will this flying reptile be better than Metrophodon? Ooh, level 1, 2,123 health and 357 attack. Okay. I mean, it's level 1, right? It was nothing we can't expect but greatness at this point. We'll tap to open. Yes. So, oh wow, look at you, got a huge beak. The Cryolaburginia has a distinct head shape, making it easy to identify no matter the distance. Uh, I guess so. I don't even, we'll call it Melon Head. And hold on, is it Me- No, that's not the one. There you go, Melon Head. We'll call it that one. <laughs> oh, so Evo 2, Evo 3, and Evo 4. Oh, it doesn't look too much different. It just has like a spiky hairdo. Right, we may as well feed it to level 10, 3,184 health and 536 attack. So again, like I've said in the past, when it comes to a hybrid, you never want to keep it level one or level 10. You always want to get another one. Oh, it's 74. That Oh, we're taking a little bit of a... Oh, right. Well, there we go. That's not a good one. Sweet. We'll just collect all of the DNA on this island. And I think... No. Yeah, it doesn't scroll over. We should really have two of those. Um, and we can now go into hybrids. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. Yes, level 10. Uh, so we want to evolve. Go to market. So it would be 83,000. Actually, wow. That is... <gasps> where is... Where is Mer Metrophodon? Wait, hold on. <gasps> 55? So that has 5,600 and... Oh, oh, this is like the third most expensive. Wait, what? Dilophoboa? Oh, because I don't have D-Low Gen 2. Ah, okay, there we go. <laughs> 74,000! And we may as well speed it up because we've got the bug. We can splash it just a little bit. Right, so that's a level 2. We'll feed you up to evolve. And now we can't, unfortunately, do a free one, although it should be soon, actually. Um, and there you have it, a level 20 as 5,455 out of 980 attack. Ooh. That is more... I think that's more health than the regular one, I think, isn't it? Like, the, the regular, um... Oh, yes, we'll claim some more food. Why not? The Cryoloth of Virginia has a smaller wingspan than the of Virginia, though they are no less powerful. Yeah, so you got this guy, and then we kind of change its colors, which is interesting. Okay, but does it? Oh, wait, wait, what happened? Oh, did it just did it just gather all of its coin? Did everybody just gather coin? Oh my god, everyone just gathered the coin. What just happened? 100%. Everyone just wow. Okay, well that was weird. Anyway, so we've got 22 days before we can get the instant hatches. The only problem is we need the DNA. So I'm not going to spend any more just to level this guy up, but I kind of do want to check that out in comparison. So at the moment, 5,400. Right, let's let's go in the market, man. Let's go in the market and let's see just how good this thing is. So 11,000 health and 1,980 attack. So it has a lot of health in comparison to Spino. It, ooh, actually, it's a lot worse than Spino <laughs> because Spino has like 600 less health, but has almost like double the attack. So for 600 health and double the attack. Yeah, you'd rather have Spino. And against Armo Mata, ooh, ooh. Oh, do we want to get this level 40 for the for the same price? Um, and, well, exactly the same price as Armor Matter. We can basically just get something that's way better. And Chroma Spino is a little bit cheaper by like 200. And that's at half price. Wow, okay. So, yeah, we don't want to use this anymore. <laughs> level 20, we kind of want to keep it there. But that's my honest opinion. I don't think there's any need to get this. Um... Yes, you get, what, double the health of a Metrophodon, but you don't even get half the attack of a Metrophodon. Because Metrophodon, if we scroll down, all the way down here, 
20,000 less, by the way. So you buy 10 of them, you're saving 200,000. Yes, do it. <laughs> and you get 5,500, oh, sorry, 255 attack and only half the health. For double, if not triple the attack, almost triple the attack, you get half the health. Yeah, you'd rather do that because it's always been about attack when it, attack when it comes to this game. So, ooh, there we go. A few little speed ups. It's not really... It always feels like in Just World Alive, you go, you progress through the levels really quick. But in this, not so much. No. Uh, okay, so let's have a look. What, what have we got going? Okay, Battle for Survival. Last time I did a Battle for Survival, I broke the game. So I kind of don't want to do that. But we all... Ooh, we have a Pterosaur event. Um, is it only one Pterosaur? Right, it's only one Pterosaur. So we can pretty much put in you... And then just go to the smallest. And as long as we have, like, one pterosaur like you, we're good to go. And then we can complete this in one turn. Sweet! His banana fingers and he's dead. Oh, dear. <laughs> Dometricanus, I think that is. The uh, Conoraptor. Conoraptor? Good dinosaur. Is Dometricano even better? Technically, yes, because it's free. Um... And I, I mean, as long as you get Carnaraptor, then it's free. And you're going to get Carnaraptor anyway, because Carnaraptor is one of the best dinosaurs. Um, so, with this one, we can do exactly the same, right? Yeah, we don't even... Like, we could choose a carnival that's way weaker than any of these. It doesn't even need a thousand attack. It can just have that. And then we've won. And we just need to scroll... Ooh, a free sweet. Scroll those... And then, yeah, so I don't even need to use my best creatures. It will be a bit tougher when we get to the next round, or the next two rounds, because they should be only Pteranodons, I think. But at least we get to see, you know, a level 20 in action. It's a shame that it, you know, it's in terrible lighting, but, you know, we, if we, do I have the recoveries, actually? I might have the recoveries. So what we'll do is once we do this one, we'll take it into the regular uh, battle event. Okay, so we are getting some DNA. And, wow, okay, now that's up to 15. Sweet. <laughs> Back to Nubla. Um, we'll go into here. Now, what do we get for the Therizinosaurus? We oh, get a Therizinosaurus, guaranteed. We get 100. Oh, yes, this is way better. Okay, so we need... Oh, God, even... No, we'll... do I want to? I don't think we want to really use it here, do we? Oh, my God, it's not even better at level 20. Then an Odomorphodon or a Pterodactylus. And they're VIP creatures, man. They're not even hybrids. So, I mean, the minimum we want is about 1,006... 1,700 attack. That's the minimum. Because then we can kill them all in one hit. So, we'll put in Zalmonodon. And I'm not even going to uh, use those other guys. Oh, wow. Never mind. It wasn't half the attack. It was quartering the attack. <laughs> so, I, d I didn't even need Zalmonodon. I could have probably used something a lot weaker. Something with, well, like, 1,200 attack base? Yeah, I don't even need this guy. But we may as well use it. It's very good, and it's level 40. Ooh. Still not as good as Metrophodon. I think when I made this level 40, I said to myself, yeah, still not as good. And now they've put another hybrid in that is technically even worse than Salmonidon. Oh, dear. It's a, it does it does boggle like the mind. You know, Dressing World Alive has this constant turning over of really good thing. Oh wow, and it's even worse now. Sweet. Um yeah. Like that'll do. Although actually saying that, I do need That's probably not gonna do it. Um Pterodactylus. Why do we have a level eleven Tapathelithus or whatever it's called? Yeah, we'll just go for loads of attack. Right, Tappy, Tappy, whatever. We're gonna we're gonna feed that thing up past level eleven. I don't know why I don't have that at level eleven. That's that's preposterous. Oh, right, we'll just go for two attacks. Oh, he blocks for two. Of course, he blocks for two. He hates it. He hates it. Well then, what are you gonna do then, huh? What are you gonna do? Gonna do that? No, you know, I gotta go and kill you. Actually, why do I do that? <laughs> I've dragged this battle longer than it needs to be. Nazuda. Oh, yeah, that is Nazuda Ceratops. Was it always Nazuda? No, was it? Was, it? was this always Nazuda Ceratops? I've forgotten what it looks like. No, it's coming to me. Yes. 
Yes, it was. It was brown, wasn't it? It wasn't red. We t it turned into Red Bull when we uh, when we got this. So 500. A Therizinosaurus to, you know, eventually just chuck in to uh, the DNA. Grind it. Meat of his stiff. Uh, what else we got? We'll put, like, something in and then we'll have a look to see what our best ones that we can sell are. Let's have a look. Uh, oh my god, I've got 17 of these. Metro... <laughs> what's, it? what's it called again? A uh, micro -pursuitous. Microsoft. Oh, yes. Heck yeah. Again, this was probably, it's it's like a, a hangover from when you used to be able to refresh the mystery packs or the battle stage infinites um, just by closing the game and reopening it. And then you could keep on doing that until you got a legendary pack, buy it for 200 and odd bucks, maybe make a profit. Maybe you, you very unlikely that you would get two, you know, you get 500 bucks. Um, but you, you'd make a loss, but you'd get so much for it. Uh, but they changed that. So that's fun. <laughs> uh, we'll do Indoraptor level 40. Why not? Let's go see that. Um, and I think, oh God, this is really tough. Like the like, Tijongosaurus. And it's got what level 3,656. Uh, I mean, as long as we just... That'll do. That'll do. I don't think we've got anything to worry about at this point. Tajong. Little Toji. Toji is a spiky boy. Although, uh... Oh, we could have one, actually. I could have went for three, I suppose, and definitely guaranteed the kill. Um, but I, I, don't, I don't need to be, uh, strategic about this. Really. Because I, this, <laughs> this not, I'm not worried at all. So we'll, we'll factor in one. Can we get a... Yeah, I did good. <laughs> right. You are a little bit tougher because I think I think it still takes three to kill you. Wow. Oh, like, so, oh my god. Oh, 4,500. I think I might have had one block. We'll go for two. And we do kill it. Oh, okay, cool. Sweet. I have to go for two again. Damn it. I'm just stupid. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, he hangs on. Right, so now I know it's only got two blocks. So we can go for that. And then, you know what? What, what are the chances? What are the chances the little Toji is going to go for a full-on four attack? Even if it does, it's, it's, it's going to die the next turn anyway. Yes. We get to kill it definitely in two. But will it go for more than three blocks? No, it doesn't. Yes. Ah, that's another rare pack. Sweet. And that should be another mission, actually, because I think we need to open three packs. So 100 DNA. Uh, oh, 1,500 DNA. Oh, yes. I like that. And another 260 VIP points. You know, we it's like savings. You just put that in a corner and forget about it. All your pennies until eventually, 10 years later, you come back to it and you've got, like, a middle. <laughs> uh, right. Okay, so what else do we have? We got this. Um, yeah, there it is. Oh, another 35 bucks. Sweet. What was I doing? I was going to do something completely... Oh, yes! Feed. I was going to feed the super hybrid. Uh, it's one of these. Go to. There it is. I mean, you may as well get it. I mean, this thing only costs super DNA, right? And I could sell it for... <gasps> I never knew they sold for that much. <laughs> You need the over. Oh! <laughs> right, okay. Ooh, yes, a little bit more. Get a little bit more. Did I actually. Did I. 60 minutes for a bony to stop? Really? Okay, fine, I guess. Uh, yes, we were gonna do the. Challenge. You know what it is? I actually want to do. I love that sound effect. I love when it repeats. Oh, it's just the best. We'll put you in, right? Then we'll put in two really weak dinosaurs. Oh, wait. This isn't the mods? Yeah, one of the mods. Um, so, yes. Hold on. Uh, excuse the incessant noise in the background. Uh, so, what do we... You, you want to put nullifying on this guy, right? So, you nullify that. So, it doesn't matter what they do. They can't do anything to you. And then with the other ones, we can in increase its attack by 10%. Which, oh, wait, how much is it? 100. If it's 10%, doesn't make a difference. 500. Ooh, it's actually better to not split wound, but to go for endurance. Because you get 15%, and that's going to be more than 500. 
please tell me I'm going to close it if it's Cenozoic. Come on, don't be Cenozoic. Don't be Cenozoic. Don't be even one. Not even one. Yes, yeah, sweet. Okay, it's actually doable. I think we could do this. We might be able to win. So we start with 5,455. But we get like 6,000 each time. So we nullify the split wound, which is great. And we get... Oh, it's 800 even. Oh, yes. I mean, it's got loads of health and then 900. We may as well just up it, right? So, yep, you give yourself extra. And what does that do? Invigorate. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, it does make a difference. <laughs> He's dead in the first go. However, yeah, you can't touch this. It's interesting that it used to be a case of, you know, like, Rajas would only take effect once it came in. But it took effect. Oh, yeah, we nullified anyway. Oh, okay, sweet. Oh, wait. Has he already got his attack increase, though? Is that how they've got past making nullifying OP? It might be, you know. Okay, okay. I've still got 7,200. Oh! Right, I'm gonna buffer one because I'm a little bit worried. I could sacrifice 900 health for a Majungasaur. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I should have done that. Okay, we're, def we're definitely gonna do that now. <laughs> okay, okay. So we'll switch you in. Oh, but you're going to die. You're all going to die in here. Right, you got five. You die in four. So hopefully it goes for four. Well, you die in one. But, you know, it, it thinks. Because I remember back in the day, I was actually I was on a call with Vertigo, actually. Um, and I, I was talking to him about, like, how, how people would not believe that these were bots. Didn't matter what you said to them. They're like, nope, they're real people. Don't care. Uh, it was it was it was amazing. It was, a, it was a magical time back when mobile gaming was in its infancy. It felt so. We'll factor in that one, and then at this point, he himself has a level one common. <laughs> he goes from one thousand four hundred attack to eight. So yeah, we should we should yeah put that one. <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Well, it could go for five. I would. Be, I'm a bit worried if he attacks. Okay, he doesn't sweep. Um, you know what it is? I'm going to go for two block here. Go for four reserve because I want to see its max attack. I think it just flies over and just like does a few little grapples with its feet. Um, but it maybe picks you up. Um, I'm thinking that's that's probably just real alive. Oh, it went for seven. Oh, my God. That damage. 72. <laughs> my friend has a fear of the number 72. So he, that would have really scared him. <laughs> Oh, full on aid attack. Okay, so against an amphibian, level 20 does 27,000 uh, damage. And you know what's kind of worrying is sometimes that wouldn't even be enough to kill some of the infinite battle creatures. That's, that's scary. <laughs> but a leader boosted prize. Is that the biggest? Is that the biggest prize? Oh, oh, Capris, I'll take it. Uh, oh, we didn't get another one. Ah, oh, sweet. Okay, so... Oh, yeah, it was the best prices. So you have a 1% chance for that. And what about here? A 1% chance for that. What's the difference? What is the difference? Is it like less chance, like 7% chance for the DNA? And 7% chance. What? Okay, maybe it's the amount of like prizes are different, like 20 DNA to 200 DNA. Okay, that, that is weird though. Right, so let's have a look at this the herbivore heritage. So, you're probably going to get a super rare. Meh. 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 It's four battles. What is the first battle? Uh, oh, it's oh, oh, it's going to be one of these cases where it's like a herbivore, a carnivore. And then uh, the last one will be like all three. But, I mean, it's, you know what? It is 750, so I, I can't really say no to it. And what's great about this... It's actually, they're really quick battles because I can put in something that can do like max damage straight away like that. And already, that's 50 each. Ah, see? It all adds up. And 90. I'm not, do I'm not doing a thing for 90. Um, Plum and Owen, man. I've got bigger things on my plate. Right, so we'll go for you. And I'll, Yeah, I don't need any more, man. <laughs> oh, it's all herbivores. Interesting. I thought the next one might have switched up. But I guess that makes sense. It's a herbivore pack, isn't it? Stupid things loud. I know, right? But <laughs> it's amazing that your comments, I heard that all the way through. 
All the way to here. <laughs> right, so the next one I'm assuming will be three. And then the final one will also be three. So there you go, there's another 50. And just use you. Yeah, whatevs. Um, I don't think any of them had more. We've got, what, a Labyrinthiosaurus, which has probably got the most health. Then Edmontosaurus. And then Segnosaurus? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it is. And Montessori, look at you. I think you had your own unique animation, actually. Or maybe you didn't. Maybe you are just a parasol. God knows. And it is Segnosaurus. We need another... Or a... Oh, I, I don't even... Why are these always so quiet? I, I have no idea. I need to fix that. Make them louder. I don't know whether I need to make the audio file louder, but I think they're always the same. Something. Some setting I've got to, I've got to look at, I'm sure. Right, okay. What else? Oh, are we... Are we, are we... are we have a little bit of an issue here? Are we... Oh, there it is. Another 50, sweet. And the final one is... Not difficult. Almost a Panasaur at level 40 can take them on. But I'm not going to do that. We're going to use one mono, mono Stegotops level 40 with 1,885. Bam! <laughs> Poor... This thing's died so many times. And now it's a parrot. Ooh trust it. You see what it did with its hand there? It has its hands down here and then went like and broke it. Like, keep my arm like that and then it went eh, with its hand. Oh, I should have just went for one, actually. Oh, grab boost cash and Rexy DNA in Jurassic World. This was two months ago. Oh, two minutes. <laughs> two minutes ago. <laughs> Hold on. I'm kind of curious. What do you mean grab Rex? Oh. You know, it'll be, it'll be the paid for incubator. That's what it'll be. It won't be free. Don't, don't be stupid. Nothing's for free. Except for this herbivore heritage. Heck yeah. And out of all of that, I got, I did get an epic. Or legendary or whatever. Which I guess isn't so bad. But we didn't get any DNA apart from that. And we do have this, which is for two days and the max prize. I think I have this thing. But, oh, 7,000 DNA. Have we got three of those? We should probably do that. Okay, we'll do one. We'll do one. Because um, I just want to see. Now, normally when it comes to the VIP uh, battles. Oh, God, definitely not. They're a lot, like, quicker to get to the top. But that doesn't mean they're easier. Um, normally. Oh, 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 okay. We'll see. We'll see. I know, like I said, I normally find, oh god, this is going to be a long one, isn't it? <laughs> normally, they just kill me straight away. Because this also is a Majungasaurus, it's going to be like, mm, no, I'm going to think about my things, even though they're pre-programmed. I'm going to swap, watch, it'll instantly go for its attacks, right? Ready, and boom! Nobody does that. Nobody swaps in something, and then goes and puts everything on it. Even then, sometimes they're like a block here or attack there and a reserve, so... It just should, it, at this point, there's no there's no point heading. I don't think they are. I think they, I think Lugia are fine if any, like even if I say that they're bots because they are. But it was it was always like this thing back in the day. I remember I did um, a paid for... It was like Odd Wings, I think it was called. I still remember it because it was my first ever like sponsored video where a company got in touch with me and said oh we'll actually pay you to make a video on our game and I was like you've, you've got to be kidding <laughs> really that's a thing and would you believe that that never happened with Universal I don't think I was ever ever been paid for a Jurassic video ever I think I hope I'm hope I'm right about that but not Universal never done it. anyway in that that game there was like a multiplayer mode um, and I think I mentioned in the multiplayer that these weren't real people. Like, you weren't racing real people, you were racing, like, ghosts or tracks or bots or whatever. Like, I just knew they weren't real people. Um, and I think in the cha list of changes they, they wanted made, they wanted that taken out. They were like, no, 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 no. You can't say that, even though it's true. They're real people. <laughs> yeah, actually, they probably said, like, uh, oh, take that out. But they didn't say why. But I knew why. Because they didn't want it out there. But, you know. Because that, that's the thing. When this game, Just a World, the game came out, um, everybody thought they were real people. And even in Jurassic Park Builder, we knew that they were bots. Which is interesting. Because you think with Jurassic World, the game, they would, you know, change it and make it real people. They didn't. 
We'll see how quickly we... If we get to... We start a recruit, don't we? Hatchling. If we get a recruit, then... That means we're going pretty high. Yeah, that doesn't... Okay, so... You need at least two... Like, a good battle. A good battle and you can get in there. So maybe it could be worth it. And I think, actually, even just getting to the top is probably worth it. Because you get super DNA. I think. We'll have a look. I'm noticing I've got something to collect, and I think that's what that is probably telling me. Oh no, it's just, it's, it's boss DNA, yeah. Oh, we got a petty dinosaur. Hold on, I have one of these ready for these exact moments. Yeah, it's a tabby, yes. I've got exactly 10 of these, because if I get that, I think it's every week or is it every couple of days? Um, we can just quickly go through, not even worry, and boom, done. 18 DNA, and is this good? Oh, okay. Oh, and it's rage. Right, let's go. Let's go. Let's hopefully not mess this up. We got 200. Ah, at least the game supplies its own comedy, I suppose. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, look, there it is. The tournament. So you do get uh, Super DNA for it. And then you'll probably get it. Dominator League, Hunter League. Yeah, if you did this right away, you'd only do like maybe 10 battles. And you'd get so much. Um... Is it Super DNA? I don't even know what it's called now. No, it used to be Super DNA. Then they were like, ah, it's just red Gigantocephalus DNA. Or at least they have the names at the bottom of them, so that's nice. <laughs> I, think they've, I think that's an update. But anyway, guys, we'll end it there because, well, the game doesn't want me to do it anymore, so we'll not. <laughs> but if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye bye